Man, oh man. Damn. <laughs> Everybody's in an uproar, man. This is just like Endgame right here. Everybody is mad at you, 2K. And before I go in on this game, WWE Games, you're next. WWE 2K, you're next. Trust me. Hashtag fix WWE 2K20. Anyway, let's get into this, man. It's your boy Omega, a.k.a. Deku. You already know what time it is. Let's get, get, get it. You feel me? Anyway, man. So the hashtag is going around. This is making news right now. Fix 2K20 or NBA 2K20. They even got a hashtag with Fire Ronnie 2K. I guess it's this guy right here. And I guess this Mike Wayne guy. Listen, I try to tell you people, man. Don't buy this game, man. When you saw that gambling shit, you should have never bought this shit. When they lied and say this is Peggy 3 for 3 year olds and up and they showing gambling, you should have never bought this game. You should have never pre-ordered. And if you did pre-order the game, y'all should have canceled your pre-order. You know what I'm saying? You should have canceled that shit. Y'all didn't cancel it. So we'll, look what happened. They got your money already. So now y'all pissed off. You know what I'm saying? You have every right to be. But y'all should have never bought this shit. You know what I'm saying? Y'all should have never bought this shit. <laughs> you know? You look at this shit, y'all mad about the badges, stretch bigs, uh, shooters, slashers, whatever the fuck y'all got in these 2K games. Because I hear about slashers, big, you know, big stretches, all this shit, because of big YouTubers like Soul Illuminati and uh, countless other people. Fuck Flight Reacts, even though he's funny as hell, but you know, I had to put that out there. But anyway, man, when y'all bought this game, you should have been ashamed of yourself, man. You should have been ashamed of yourself, because... You should have canceled your pre-order. You should have canceled that shit. That's what y'all should have did. Y'all should have canceled your pre-order. But instead, y'all still kept this shit. You still kept the pre-order. Now that the game fucked up on some day one. Day one is A. Day one. Day one is A. Now y'all want to cry and complain when all you had to do was not buy the game, period. You know, people like me, smart people like me, we didn't buy this shit because we don't support child gambling. We don't support that shit. Y'all on the mean hand, y'all support this shit. Now you're crying. You're upset because the game is broken. Blue screens, uh, you know, uh, what else? Badges, you know. And as y'all can see, this is live. Y'all over here are pissed off, man, when you didn't even have to buy it. Niggas really spent over $100 on 2K just for it not to work. You see, y'all should have never done that, man. You should have never bought this game. And you should have never gave them $100. For what? Shit, they lied to you. Y'all said Ronnie 2K lied to y'all. I don't know what he lied to y'all about, but hey, you should have never bought the game. You should have never bought this shit. You should have just said, fuck it. Because they don't care about y'all, man. They make their money off pre-orders. They make their money off pre-orders. When y'all saw that fucking uh, trailer with Cash Nasty and LSK acting like coons and sellouts and clowns and dancing for almighty daddy 2K, you should have said, oh, hell no. Nah. Uh-uh. But since they got a lot of pull in your community, y'all still bought this game anyway. And guess what? You deserve everything you get. I don't feel bad for you. I really don't. Hell, in this photo right here of my boy, of my boy right here, proves it. Even he can see this shit. My boy Stevie Wonder could see this shit. And, and this clown emoji is just, you know what, that clown emoji right here with the little frog y'all see on the screen? That's y'all. Because y'all was the clowns. Y'all still bought this shit. I know somebody gonna get mad, but I don't give a fuck if you're mad. The truth hurts. You the one that paid over a hundred dollars for this shit. You're a clown. You're a goofy. You're a jokey. You're a silly. You're a slurper. Big time slurper. You slurping. When anybody who saw that fucking that fucking trailer of gambling, they would have been they would have been canceled that shit. They wouldn't even buy this game. Y'all bought it, so serve you right. Serve you motherfuckers right. I don't feel bad for you. I don't. Shit, if I was, if I love basketball that fucking much and I saw some shit that 2K did, hell no. And it's very sad that once upon a time, 2K was known for being one of the most best developers in the world at one point in time. And God ogly, how the mighty have fallen. 
this this right here, y'all some clowns, man. That's why I'm not mad at y'all. Because you had the option to cancel your pre-order. You had the option to not buy this game. But you said, fuck that. You're going to buy it anyway. And now you're bitching. They made their money on y'all. They made their money. They got their money. They make their money off pre-orders. This is why I always tell people, man, never pre-order a game without knowing every fucking thing. And y'all fell for it, bro. Hook, line, and sinker. That Ronnie 2K guy... He sold you motherfuckers a dream. He sold y'all a dream. He told y'all everything was going to be okay. Everything was going to be all right. And turned around and bent y'all over. And y'all took it with no lube. Like he lied to y'all. Now y'all want to fire the guy. <laughs> this is your fault. Don't be, don't, y'all shouldn't, matter of fact, and I blame the bigger, I blame the people who are the face of your company. I blame them. I blame that Cash Nasty dude. I blame that LSK dude. LSK was the main one crying when 2K blocked him. He was the main one. He's the main one that said, oh, I shelled out over $1,000 free LSK, blah, blah, blah. Dude, we didn't forget that. At least I didn't forget it. But you was crying. Then when NBA Live decided, okay, you know what? We fuck with you. We go put you in our game. You was ungrateful. You didn't even play their game. Here we are now. I guess they gave you some money and everything's okay. Get out of here, bro. Use a sellout, bro. Use a sellout, my guy. You're a sellout. And you lost all respect from me. Now everybody else want to kiss your ass. They're more than welcome, but you lost respect from me, buddy. Now as far as Cash Nasty go, he always been a sellout. Let's be real. His videos are boring. You know, I watched one of his videos and that was it. That was it. You know, I don't even like the dude's channel. It's boring, you know? I don't even know how I don't even know how he got a million fucking uh subscribers. I'm still scratching my head about that. <laughs> but anyway, man, I'm done. I have nothing else to say, man. Serve you motherfuckers right, man. Anyway, it's your boy Omega AK Deku. Follow me on that Twitter at the Omega Winner. That's my Twitter handle. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and basically share my video on Twitter, man, you know, so I can retweet you, you know? But anyway, man, I'm signing out, man. Y'all some clowns, y'all some goofies, and y'all deserve this. Hands down. This is your fault. Accept it.